China is a mystical country, home to ancient mysteries, iconic places, modern marvels, and the world's oldest continuous civilization. Whether you're trekking up the Great Wall or sampling a dish of dim sum, China is sure to inspire, excite, and amaze. Hi, I'm Juliana, a student ambassador alum from Idaho. I'm here to tell you about an amazing two and a half week journey. That's right, I'm talking about your Great Wall and Beyond program. From ancient pagodas to meeting local students your own age, you have the journey of a lifetime just waiting for you. I should know, I've already traveled to nine countries with people to people. Your Great Wall and Beyond program starts in China's capital and one of the world's most mysterious and rapidly changing cities. Welcome to Beijing. Beijing beautifully mixes thousands of years of history with ultra modern skyscrapers. And in this amazing city, you'll find some of China's most iconic places. The Forbidden City is a massive palace complex and was home to China's emperors for more than five centuries. It boasts 9,999 rooms and nine courtyards. I'm thinking maybe nine was an important number in ancient China. Commoners weren't even allowed inside the Forbidden City until 1925, hence the name. But you'll get to wander its monumental buildings as freely as a king. You'll even see Tiananmen Square. Then you'll get a completely different view of Beijing, riding in a pedal-powered rickshaw through the old Hutong neighborhoods. Hutongs are alleys formed by rows of traditional courtyard residences. With some dating back to the 13th century, many Hutongs have been demolished to make way for the modern skyscrapers of Beijing. Fortunately, China has declared specific Hutongs as protected areas to help preserve this piece of their cultural history. And you'll be lucky enough to visit one. Of course, no visit to China would be complete without seeing the Great Wall. You'll climb well-worn steps to stroll along a stretch of this massive wall. Originally designed to keep people out of China, now it's a great reason for people to come in, exploring what's left of its 3,000 miles of fortification. You will literally be standing on a piece of global history. Your time in Beijing won't just be about amazing places. You'll get to explore some of China's rich culture as well. At a local cooking school, you'll get a chance to meet chefs in training, learn some of their lessons for yourself, and explore China's out-of-this-world flavors. This isn't something the average tourist has access to. Plus, this isn't your American version of Chinese food. Think fresh and healthy ingredients, perfectly prepared little bites, and a whole range of flavors from sweet to salty. You'll prepare your own dish of dim sum and then dig in with your delegation. China's art isn't just culinary. Kung Fu, Kung meaning energy, and Fu meaning time, is a Chinese martial art developed by Buddhist monks who believe that a strong body would prevent the disciples from falling asleep during meditation. While in Beijing, you'll study Kung Fu with students at a local school. These kids may look small, but believe me, they pack a punch. How many people can say they've gotten a Kung Fu lesson from an eight-year-old? Student ambassadors can. Next, it's time to meet up with some of China's most famous residents, giant pandas. There are only a few thousand of these majestic creatures left in the entire world. Student ambassadors get to go behind the scenes and meet with a zoological expert at the Beijing Zoo. During this special opportunity, you'll learn all about the effort being made to save these magical creatures. It's an experience I'm sure you're never going to forget. Then it's time to say goodbye to Beijing and kick back in your sleeping berth. That's right, an overnight train ride will steam you inland to the eternal city, known as Xi'an. If you've never been on an overnight train before, it's super cool and another unique experience student ambassadors get to enjoy. The next morning, you'll be met at the city gates with a welcome celebration, complete with costumes and music. It's a way of honoring important visitors, and student ambassadors are recognized as very special guests. In a city with more than 3,100 years of history, you might be asking what your must-see experience is. Well, of course, it's the world-famous Terracotta Warriors. Buried centuries ago, these clay warriors were created to defend Emperor Qin Shi Huangdi in the afterlife. Each warrior was carved with unique features and details, and pearls were pressed into the ceiling of the pit to represent a starry sky. In a people-to-people -people exclusive, you'll also meet the farmer who stumbled upon this treasure in the 1970s. You'll also have the chance to get your hands dirty and help mold miniature replicas of these fierce warriors. They make great souvenirs. See? Definitely a step up from a bobblehead. You'll finish your time in Xi'an with a peek into the Buddhist faith at the small wild goose pagoda. While there are many religions practiced in China, about 100 million Chinese people consider themselves Buddhists. At the pagoda, you'll get to take part in a special program to learn an ancient form of Chinese painting. Then you're off to Guilin. You may not know this, but China's natural beauty is just as stunning as its man-made landmarks. Here, you'll experience the iconic jagged mountains known as the Dragon's Teeth, the wandering Li River, and even Guilin's inner beauty when you go underground at the Guanyan Cave. 
This network of elevators, boats, and rail cars will take you deep into the earth to discover some unbelievable rock formations. You'll feel like you're on the set of an adventure movie. Then it's time for the most important part of your student ambassador program, your two night stay in Hongyang Village. It's an entire community dedicated to showing hospitality. This is your time to connect with warm people of your host country and experience amazing people to people moments. You'll immerse yourself in rural village culture in a way that a regular tourist never could. Help the village farmers in their orchards, share a meal with your host family, play a pickup game of basketball, and speak English with the local students. Many of China's top students come from Guilin, so you could almost think of this village as a gigantic honor society. China sends more students to American universities than any other country. So in a few years, who knows? Your new friends here might become your classmates. You'll play local games and have fun learning a Chinese country dance. Then, it's your turn to teach your new friends a few moves of your own. My go-to is the Macarena. On your last day in Guilin, soak in the peace and quiet when you paddle along the Li River in bamboo rafts. This truly is one of the world's most beautiful places. Every bend in the river will reveal an incredible new landscape for you to capture. What a perfect way to end your stay in this peaceful community. Then it's time to explore one of China's biggest metropolises, Shanghai. Did you know more than 1.3 billion people call China home? That's 1 billion more than the US. And 16 million of these folks live in Shanghai. So what's the best way to explore this populous city? How about from the skywalk of the Oriental Pearl TV Tower? The glass floor of the skywalk provides a dizzying view of the city almost 1,000 feet below. Bend your mind around the feats of a Shanghai troupe of acrobats. You'll have a people-to-people -people moment when you meet the performers and get a sneak peek of their skills before watching the jaw-dropping show. With people-to-people, -people, it's never just about seeing the world. Giving back to the countries you visit is an important part of becoming a global citizen. You'll spend some quality time with special needs students at the Qi Xing School. When you play games, sing songs, or read stories, it's actually an important chance for these students to practice their social skills. It's impossible not to feel good here when you share a laugh with these children. And the kids love it. Believe me, you'll come home with your own Chinese fan club. It's time to bid goodbye to Shanghai when you head off to Suzhou. Suzhou is one of the oldest towns in Yangtze Basin. And here, you'll study a truly ancient Chinese art, ping pong. As a student ambassador, you'll have a rare opportunity to visit a school that trains young athletes in the time-honored game. Even if you have a lot of practice and a mean backhand, chances are good that there's a six-year-old at this school who can beat you. But don't get discouraged. You'll still have a great time making friends during a quick lesson and some friendly competition. Then you'll get an inside look at another art form born in Suzhou called Kun Opera. This is definitely unlike anything you've ever experienced. Talk with local opera performers and their teachers to understand their dedication to their craft and its powerful history. Everyone can go to a performance, but only student ambassadors can go behind the scenes to meet the actors. From Suzhou, you're off to Wujen, an ancient water town that was built over 1,300 years ago. With doors that open onto bridges or canals, this magical place has been carefully protected and restored. You'll have the opportunity to stay in a local guest house and get a true understanding of what life on the water is like. You won't believe it, but it will be time to begin your journey home via the bullet train to Shanghai. One last amazing experience before boarding your flight to the States. Just imagine, next summer, you could be learning how to play ping pong from Chinese students, exploring ancient palaces and pagodas, taking a bamboo raft ride down a peaceful river, and laughing your way through an unforgettable adventure, all while gaining a whole new understanding of the world. I actually have a different view of the world now, of other people, even of myself, because of people-to-people -people programs. I've been inside other cultures, I've learned that I'm more capable than I believed, and I have new friends and family on the other side of the world. Take the first step in your student ambassador journey. It's your time now. Get ready for the world.